It's a great pleasure to welcome you all to what I guess is the second 24-hour university lecture-thon, but actually the third in the series. Just to give you a little bit of history, in November 2011, our colleague Tim, Dr. Tim Richardson lectured continuously for 24 hours on a very wide range of topics. And as part of this, he raised over £8,000 for children in need. Tragically, less than eight months after this, Tim was diagnosed with terminal cancer and sadly died just over a year ago in February 2013. In both memory of Tim and also to continue his outstanding Two, fundraising one. through the Charity Inspiration for Life, we have a fantastic range of talks on an extensive range of topics from across the university and also including a number of external speakers. Please enjoy yourself and learn something new because this is what Tim would have wanted. I've just listened to a talk by Elena Rodriguez Falcon. Uh, about uh, engineering and uh, she gave a talk with some very ex students. It was very inspiring. We've come early because I'm the little man. Say hello Alex. It's going really well so far, really fantastic actually. Um, so we've had about six or seven speakers, really diverse in terms of what they're talking about. I notice we've got one or two people who are dressed up in their pyjamas. changed into my nightwear for the nighttime phase of this year's 24 hour inspire. It doesn't really start getting rowdy until later on, but it will get quite rowdy later on, I suspect. Whoop like a chimpanzee. I am dressed as the mysterious messenger who commissioned the Requiem. Who would win the Wildlife Weird Sex Award? <laughs> there, was, there was the pole dancing one as well. There was the pole dancing one. was the pole one, dancing Which Ben featured in. <laughs> featured, yeah. <laughs> it is going absolutely amazing. Uh, the kind of things I've heard is just uh, from gas to all sorts of wonderful things. Which one this is? I look like a skeleton. Apparently it's the cat. I learned so much. Alright. I feel better as a Alright. Good. Uh, it, it is Tim's legacy. Mm. Mm. And yeah, he was a, he was a very inspirational person. I mean, if it wasn't for him, I, I wouldn't be in my third year in uni now. Probably would be somewhere else, not as happy as I am right now.